great students of Bethel Academy. Again, welcome to STEM EDU Live Studios, STEM in Education, Sea, Air, and Space, Principles of Engineering. I'm Mr. Johnson, and today we're talking about Air Lab 1.1. Okay. Air T minus 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Mission liftoff. Hot air balloon is one of the first concepts in flight. This is an indoor hot balloon tester. And this hot balloon tester sends off heat. The most valuable thing about this indoor balloon tester in energy, there's three processes. Conduction, induction, and convection. The fluid that's coming out of this indoor hot balloon tester, can anyone guess what kind of fluid that's going to be coming out of here? Yes, we want to use air. Now, with involving technology, we talk about tools, we talk about resources, we talk about materials, we talk about technological systems, and the biggest thing is this, design process. The first stage is getting to know the possibilities technology, literacy, and systems, materials you want me to use, the resources, how does these things operate to arrive at a solution, which is called possible solutions. Possible solutions, engineering, drawing, and design, but you have to take down measurements. And these measurements have to be shown, not just in numbers, but it has to be shown what it looks like as far as on the dimensions of the objects that you work with. If you're talking about the length of an object, you have to show the measurements of the length. If you're talking about the height of the measurements. That's for a great question to ask, and that's a great concept to explore. During the engineering process, we think about loads and forces. We definitely want this balloon to stay together. We don't want it to fall apart or have any openings because it wouldn't rise. Or if it tear or if it splits, there's a problem. The static and dynamic systems. The static system involves the hot air balloon itself. Dynamic systems involves that, that flow of fluids, which brings us to thinking mathematically. Thinking mathematically, what is the volume of this hot air balloon? There's a formula. Formula for calculate volume for hot air balloon is V equals Four divided by three times pi r cube, r to the third power. The volume of this hot air balloon is 19,724.31 cubic centimeters. This hot air balloons weigh 20 grams. We can calculate the density by using Archimedes principles, because density equals mass divided by volume. We know the mass, 20 grams. The volume is 19,724.31 cubic centimeters. And you have your density. Okay, let's take the room temperature. The room temperature shows 30 degrees Celsius. What's the temperature in this balloon? The room temperature is 30 degrees Celsius. Is there any air in this balloon right now? And what's the temperature? 30 degrees Celsius. The reason why this balloon is not in the air at this time is because it has the same temperature as in the room. What we're going to do is heat up the temperature in the balloon using this balloon tester. And we're gonna find out if we can make this rise. Once it gets to 50 degrees Celsius. So we're gonna compare 30 degrees and 50 degrees. The fourth process is testing and evaluation that we're going to demonstrate today. That 30. All right, everyone, can you help me count down? T minus 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 
two, one. Mission liftoff. 